Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and what a perfect day it is for using DistroKid's newest program, Mixia, for mastering. That's right. The conditions are perfect for an amazing day of mastering. And, you know, it looks like it's going to be easier than ever before. It's time for the first drive. It looks like he's going for the 24-bit 48K high-res wave format. I believe all mastered files are available in this format. Right you are. Let's check in on the fairway where it looks like players are previewing different sound settings and picking their favorites. Oh, and on the green, it's looking like he's about to sync that first free master track. Can he do it? And he sinks it! Wow, what a shot! And after that, it's only $99 a year to master unlimited tracks! Which is a great deal. Optimizing for streaming services. It doesn't get any better than that. On behalf of Augusta National Golf Club, I want to thank all of you for joining us for this tournament. Your support and enthusiasm have made this event truly special. We hope you all sign up to use Mixia for all your masters. Thanks for watching. Hey, what's up, you guys? Marty Schwartz here with Marty Music. We're going to break down this classic Aerosmith song right now. Uh, real quick, if you haven't, I appreciate you subscribing here to the Marty Music YouTube channel. That helps me out. And then also, I've got links below for free courses and other killer bonuses that will help you out and help me out. So that's great. I appreciate that. Um, let's break it down. All right. So the intro of the song is a G blues rock kind of thing. And then most of the rest of the song goes up to A major. So this intro. So that's one three on the A string, which is B flat to C, but as power chords. And then F G as power chords. So one three on the E string. Blues lick behind it, basically fifth fret, bend, you know, just basic blues bend right there. But then the last one. Goes up to B flat. And that is along the sixth fret. Um, it's the same as this chord but it slides up. So from the intro, ba -da -da -da. So let's go over those chords first of that intro or the verse. A major to E major, F sharp minor, which is barred along the second fret, E minor shape, E root, and then C sharp minor. And I'm going to play that where my ring finger is right now. I'm going to bar along the fourth fret with the root on the A string and the A minor shape. That gives me C sharp minor. And then I'm gonna go to a D major chord. A major. E major. Now you can, since there's two guitars, the way you pick it, you'd want to figure out how the other guitar player is going to pick it as well. But with the A chord, you could pick the um, the root and then hop over to now. If you were covering this by yourself, you just want to make sure you hit the root and then just cleanly pick the pattern. Ba one and ba da 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 da. So here are the chords, A, E, F sharp minor, C sharp minor, D, A, E, again, A, E, 
yeah. F sharp minor, C sharp minor, D, A, E. Pre-chorus now goes back to G, like in that intro. So G major to D. So that pre-chorus, one more time, is G to D, G to D. Then C to G. E major, which is a lift, and which gets us back to the key of A major. E major, oh yeah. Chorus starts now. A, E, F sharp minor, D. So it's a variation, but it's the key of A major. A, E, D. Again, I was A, E, E, F sharp minor to D. Back to D. Intro. A to E. F sharp minor, C sharp minor, D major. A, E, again, A, E, F sharp minor, C sharp minor, D, A, E, pre-chorus, G, D, some G and then Back to A, now E, F sharp minor to D, A, E, back to D. <laughs> That's later actually, but you know, some dramatic stuff there. But so that's the form of the whole song, you know. All right, there's a little bridge and it's up a half step from the key of A. So it's pretty cool little lift. You'll see how it gets us back though to the key of A again. I like it. So it's E flat major. So I'm playing that. You can do a power chord if you need to or want to. to B flat, so it's like. Twice, then down a whole step to um, A flat or G sharp, whatever you want to call it. I've been calling everything, you know, E flat, A, f so E flat, B flat. So A flat. Back to E flat. Then up a half step to E, natural. Holds it. Now chorus out. So one more time on that bridge. E flat, B flat. E flat, B flat. A flat, E flat. Up to E. That's an E. Little brown eyed girl.
So that's the A major pentatonic over that final part, which is the same thing as the F sharp minor pentatonic. All the accoutrement that you could do with that. So good luck, rock it out. All right, hope you guys enjoyed the lesson. Once again, thank you uh, for supporting Marty Music. If you haven't yet, I appreciate you subscribing to the channel. Feel free to uh, you know request stuff in the comments below. And then also while you're down there, you can check uh, that little description box. There's free courses, links for uh, the gear I use, other killer bonuses that I think will help you out. And I appreciate that extra support. So please take care. Hope to see you again.